uh, a good opportunity at this time of the year where we can um, uh, have a European Championships in an Olympic year. Uh, and this, for a lot of people, will be their stepping stone towards the Olympics. It will also be the development meet and a summer championship for a lot of other athletes. So uh, we've got four relay teams that will be selected first time in Irish history. We've had all the four of those teams there. Uh, we have a half marathon team, and then we would have a, g a good two or three handfuls of athletes. So you're talking a fairly large team of you know, 30, 35, 40 athletes potentially. So very, very pleased with those numbers. We've had a lot of injuries this year. I think a lot of athletes have kind of pushed on, tried to, 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 to up their game. Um, and at the end of the day, today we're starting to see the kind of the turnaround of those athletes coming back. Mark English, Thomas Barr, uh, again the 4x4 men. Uh, first time we've had 46 across the board for some time. So uh, you're always nervous in Olympic year. There's still time to go, but uh, very pleased with kind of the, uh, hopefully this is the turning of the, of the corner we can start uh, looking for uh, for the rest of the summer. We have some good stars, but our stars may be necessarily shining our brightest right now. You know, Tom and Mark, who have come with uh, potential European medals uh, on their minds, may not be at their top game. Uh, but at the end of the day, I, I still think we got a half marathon team that could be very competitive, possibly a medal team. Um, but surely we would look for a number of these athletes to get through semis, get into finals, get that, get that experience. For those who are going on to the Olympics, have this really as that good stepping stone to get their season right uh, with a month to go to the Olympics. People say that uh, championship running necessarily isn't gauged towards qualification, but uh, I'd say in a number of events, for example, a 4x4 relay, this meet will be critical for us to actually uh, be in the top 16 or an opportunity for us to, uh, to, uh, to drop off the back. So yes, it's, it's very important that uh, uh, I think our relay team can have an impact, and there's others that are actually there. Uh, ben Reynolds could improve on his time, for an example. Kira McGeehan, uh, she's come back after a couple of hard years of injury. She's actually run quite well in the 800 and the 1500. Uh, again, someone who could have uh, a good opportunity to make herself through the rounds and into a finals. This will really prepare her for a, a, an Olympic Games. Um, another team possibly could also be in a final is our women's 4x4 relay. We've got four girls now that have, uh, four or five girls there that, are, that put themselves in a good mix. And uh, where they're positioned now, you're seeing uh, those specific girls actually have a good opportunity to do very well for us. So look, listen, we're out there, we're gonna do our best. We've put our best foot forward and we hope to have a good championship.